What do you think the odds is that the medical community can have an open-ended conversation about a really controversial topic in a productive way without 97.8% getting 50 11 kinds of butt hurt up in they butt biscuit? Chances are zero, probably. Let's continue then. No F to the ucks do I give. D to the ams or sh to the its. What is with the redundancy in medical positions? WTF and WTMFF. What the fuck and what the motherfucking fuck? P.S. Don't care if you like cursing or not. Revert back to the first half of this video. No F to the ucks, D to the ams, sh to the its. Why is there an MD and a DO? Do away with one of them, I don't care. Why are they PAs and NPs? Do away with one of them, I don't care. The difference in those two's jobs is literally a period on the end of the same sentence. No disrespect to PAs, but I'm gonna say it like it is. If I have a choice between somebody that has worked bedside, acute care setting for five, 10, 20 plus years, and got their nurse practitioner, if I have to pick one, I'm picking the MP, I'm sorry. Nothing against you, you may be fan fucking tabulous, but pardon my fucking French, what experience did you have prior to going to PA school? Working in the lab? No, I'm sorry, that's not good enough for me and mine, I'm good. You do you, boo boo, I'm sure you're fucking great. Just explain damn why to me. Do away one of them. I don't care. Why is there 7-Eleven types of nurses? I ain't talking about specialty. I get we all do different things. Different departments. Why is there LPN, LVN, and RN? And whatever the hell else may exist out there. I'm sorry. Unpopular opinion. Love y'all to death. It ain't nothing against you. You literally go through almost the same amount of school as a two-year RN who do the exact same job. They like five things you can't do. Is it worth that much of a pay cut? I don't know. It's never made sense to me. I feel like everybody that's LPN, LVN needs to be grandfathered into RN. Take a six-month course on whatever the fuck those five differences are in our job. Three weeks, six hours, I don't care. We don't need to be 5011 types of us. We do the same shit. Why is there 5011 kinds of nurse aides? CNA 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 11. Med tech, PCT, PCA, whatever the hell else exists out there. Make them all the motherfucking same. The redundancy is ridiculous. Some positions as a CNA can go so far that you're basically fucking an RN. LPN or LVN, some kind of shit. You literally do all the skills. And same damn thing with an MA. What the fuck? It just don't make sense to me. Same thing with an EMT and advanced EMT. Just do away with the EMT and make everybody fucking advance. I mean, what the fuck? Most of these fields are getting saturated outside of bedside work. So what, we just keep making new names, making new jobs for every damn body to accommodate that don't want to fucking go inside the hospital? I don't know about anybody else in the world, but where I come from, in the land of the poor and the sick, we got more motherfucking clinics than we got goddamn Dollar Generals. And a Dollar General every two motherfucking goddamn miles. You see what I'm saying? I don't know, is there more jobs in healthcare like that? Something with respiratory? Like a RT or R R R T? Actually, I believe there is. What's the point of that? Just make everybody a mother flubbing R R R R R T R R T. Is radiology like that shit? I don't know. I don't damn get it. I don't damn get it. Somebody explain it to him. And I don't want the bullshit. I want the truth. Y'all always telling me. I'm always saying what everybody thinking. We test that theory today. This is in fact your earliest convenience. Why do we have 97 11 jobs that do the same damn thing? I feel like we need consolidated. Healthcare needs consolidated. I feel like we need to roll all of our assets into one hedge fund, one retirement fund, one fund of fuckery. Is it just me? Okay.